How to Create Your Own Software as Service Business The notion of software as a service is a very interesting one, and one that is very different from pretty much any business model that has gone before it. The idea is that you are providing a service, whether that's web design or contact management, and that this service is going to be provided automatically by using a piece of software. So, instead of building websites for your clients, you are offering a piece of software that can do that for them. The great thing about these businesses is that they can provide services that would be impossible to offer any other way, and they can allow you to take a very backseat approach to running them, generating passive or near-passive income. So, how exactly do you create such a business? One come up with the idea. The first thing you need to do is come up with your business. This is easier said than done, of course, but one useful question to ask is whether you can, in any way, productize a service that you are already providing. This is how Matt Mullenweg came up with the idea for WordPress, by asking how his web design company could be made into a product, and thereby scale to unforeseen heights. Another question is to think about the tools you use on a daily basis and how they could be better as an SAS. 2. Implement the idea. The next step is to implement the idea. The problem with this is that it will very often involve programming using a web-based programming language. This is code that will run on a server, and common languages include PHP and Python. These are very complex for beginners, which is why the best option is often to outsource the actual creation of the product to someone who knows what they're doing. Use Upwork or something similar to find the staff. Alternatively, you can try using a social network building solution, several of which do exist. 3. Market the idea. Finally, you just need to market your idea. A good place to start is with your existing client list, if you have one, and from there you can try building an email list as you would for any service. Often, SAS means B2B, but not always. Otherwise, you can try using advertising and more traditional means of internet marketing. Invest the profits you make into more advertising to scale up your business, and then watch as it grows. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.